Okay, welcome back to another chess splits video. Sorry, I haven't been posting in a while because, well, school and everything, but start starting a new game now, so. Queen's Gambit again. You can either take this, accept it, like that, or, well, normally this Baltic defense, I haven't heard of it, but, or they can normally play this move, e6. Um, I'll just bring my knight out, develop it. Choose this, and now his probably best options is just to bring his knight out, pawn forward, just to develop his pieces. Maybe get this pawn forward if he wants. Turn it to Slav kind of look. Okay, I'll just bring my other knight out. Okay. Now here, um, he he wants to take. It's a bit like the Nimzo Indian, and normally in Nimzo Indian you move your queen to c2, but now I can't do it because of the bishop. So maybe instead I'll just move my bishop out here. And just stopping the pin. He takes, okay. If I push, he takes. Wait, if I push, he, he takes. If I take, he takes. If I push, he takes. I take, he take, so I can't push here, so maybe I'll just go one forward instead, and defend this, now I just want to take this and castle on uh, my king side, maybe threats of queen here, queen to a4, now he should probably just move his knight out, yeah, castle. I'm gonna bring my bishop out, and then I can make rook here. Just castle first. So here, he has. He can either bring his knight to d7 or knight to c6, or he takes this. I don't really like that because his bishop's probably better than my knight. I can either take with pawn, which maybe opens this, rook up, or bishop. I might take with bishop though, because I don't want to get it back with pawn, which is pawn behind the other pawns. And this bishop looks, can, could be quite useful. So now here, I'm going to just bring my rook over out here, down on this good c file. So he's trying to push this pawn up to here. I'm going to push mine so stopping him from moving his pawn too forward. Now, he's attacking my knight, so... I, he's not really threatening much because if he takes my knight, I'll just take it back with the queen. Um, maybe... Just bring my rook out here, or... I'm going to bring my queen here, because if he does take, I know I'll have to move my queen again, but I don't think taking is a good option for him. Maybe he wants, maybe his plan is just to bring his um, bishop back to d5, but right now I just want to bring my rook out on this d file. Now, here, I would assume I'd probably either move my bishop here, I'd probably move bishop here actually. Queen here, that's alright. Now I'm going to bring my rook out here and threaten knight coming into e5, attacking the queen and the knight, and if the knight takes mine, so see here, the knight takes this, I'll take back of the pawn attacking this knight and the queen. And so he must move his, oh he took, well now I take this and attack this as well. So he has to move knight here, yeah. Well, right now, um, bishop here is a threat because he can't, he can't take take it because of the pin, and he'll have to move his rook out here. But that doesn't really do much. Maybe I'll. I don't really like that knight move as well. I'll take this, and if he takes back of the bishop, I can move this pawn forward. So now that's good for me. He has to go here. If he goes here, 
I can't take because he takes, I take, he takes, and gets checkmate, or my queen would have to go, but he would be in a much better position. And if he goes here, and I take, he takes, I probably could take his pawn, I'd just be a pawn up. So I probably have to do that. Um, yeah, I'll just take. I'll take his queen. And now take his pawn. So I've got double pawns, which is kind of an issue. But other than that, I've got a better position from attacking this. You could maybe play pawn two forward here. My my aim is maybe just to get bishop over onto G, to b4 and then to um e d6. So he pushed as I thought he might. I'll take. He takes back with the pawn, and then I think I might just bring my bishop in, and then get this bishop on this good square here. now I've got a better position. I want to move my pawn forward here and bring my king in. Take. Um, I'm just thinking whether I should take or not. If I take, then his pawn will take back, obviously. At least I, then I won't have um, double pawns, but this is in danger, so I probably will just push this. i got 17 seconds as well, so I have to be wary of that. My rook to defend this, and now he is probably just going to go out here. If he does that, I'll bring this back. Uh, first, I'll take, and then I'll bring it back over here. He's running long time now as well, so I'll take, take back of this, and then bring my bishop back here. I have to yeah be careful of time. Oh I can oh I didn't spot that. I could take I could have taken it straight away. And I'll take this. Because he he has to go here, otherwise I can got good oh I got good discovered check. It just gets me the bishop. Now I can pick my rook back in. And my bishop's defending the pawn as well. Well, it doesn't look so good for him. I'll um, move this. I'll um, move back actually. I don't like. I can look in. Look in. Down on the seventh rank. Yep. Yeah. Well, he resigned. Not, not much time left anyway, and my position's just winning. Oh, well. Well, this is going to be it for this video. I hope you enjoyed. Please like, subscribe, and anyway, thank you.